A popular local restaurant that's actually been profitable during the pandemic is shutting its doors by Thanksgiving. And loyal customers are not happy with what's taking its place. News 13's Courtney Allen has the story. It's a homegrown favorite. This is one of the few Italian restaurants that's locally owned and has a lot of local flavor. People like Robert Taylor and his son Monty have been going to Scarpa's at Montgomery and Eubank for years. I've been taking my children here since they were born. We moved here in 1999. I've been kind of coming in and out of Scarpa's since I was a kid. But soon it will be torn down. I think it'll be a loss. This means you have to go farther to get something to eat. No, it's not due to the pandemic. The building owner is replacing it with a Murphy USA gas station. Why do we need another gas station? There's already two gas stations within walking distance of the restaurant. If there are plenty of gas stations and there are a lack of restaurants, why take away one of the restaurants that's doing well and actually contributing? Building owner Josh Skarsgård says the new gas station will benefit people in the area and they will be building a new Scarpus in the Coors Pavilion Shopping Center near St. Pius. The original location is still on Academy. The Academy location and the Eubank location are very close. So we think we can get our food to a broader array of our customers by having a west side location. This restaurant has a flavor profile that's been loved by New Mexicans and we want to grow it. Scarsgard says they hope to increase Scarpa's locations from two to five or more statewide in the next year. Looking at places like Rio Rancho, Santa Fe, Roswell, Carlsbad and Farmington. But regulars say they hate to see the one on Eubank go. When you come here, you have a similar meal that you had when the kids were this big, and now they're this big. I'd hate to think we lose one more, you know, mom and pop type of restaurant. Courtney Allen, KRQE News 13. The restaurant says 40 people will be laid off, but Skarsgård says the goal is to rehire all of them at the Coors location. It's expected to open early next year.